Hey guys, Don't Go here, and today I'm going to change some of you's home network for good. And, of course, for better. Much better. Seriously, for the first time, the router is no longer what you think about only when your network is down, but something you want to check on daily. And you can do that from anywhere on your iPhone, your new iPad, or your new MacBook Pro. Or in my case, from on all three of them at the same time. Just because I can. Now, the routers or routers in question are those belonging to Linksys EA series from Cisco, such as this Linksys EA4500 right here. Now, I picked this one because this is the top tier N900 router that offers true dual band, with each band providing up to 450 megabit per second. On the bike, it has four gigabit LAN ports and one gigabit WAN port. There is also a USB 2.0 port to host printers or storage. In my testing, this router here offers very good performance and also very good range. What is new is the Cisco Connect Cloud that went live just a few days ago. That's a firmware that enabled the EA4500 as well as other support routers to offer a lot more features. And they can also be managed via the internet using a web interface or mobile apps for iOS and Android devices. Now, to do this, you first have to register an account with Cisco Connect Cloud, which is very easy and fast to do. It's also free. After that, you can use that account to manage multiple routers or multiple home network, that is. For example, here I have a two of them. One of them is CNET Labs, which is this one right here. And the other is the gateway for my circuit layer. Even I don't know where it is. As you can see, I can easily switch between the two networks without having to log out. And take a look. This iPad right here is actually connected to the Internet using Verizon 4G LTE. That means I can do this no matter where I am without having to be at home at the local network. Now, the Cisco Connect Cloud's interface has two parts, the router settings and the embedded apps. The router setting part include all the basic settings commonly found in routers, such as local network setting, firewall, wireless network, port forwarding, and so on. Embedded apps, a special feature of the Linksys router. Now, the biggest, also the most common feature found among EA series routers is something called media prioritization. This allows for up to three devices and or web services to be put on the high priority list. You can easily move a device or service on or off this list. Those on the list will have the internet bandwidth before the rest of the connected devices. Now, the same goes for parental control feature. See how you can enable this and pick what type of restriction easily. Again, you can do that even when you are not at home. The Cisco Connect Cloud enables third parties to develop apps for your home network. For example, here I have the Block the Bad Stuff apps from Fresh Consulting. Using this app, one log in with the Cisco Connect account. I can quickly turn on the web filtering of the home network via three filtering levels. Level one, most can go through. Level two, not so much. And at level three, the internet is basically useless for my friend Eric Franklin. Now, Cisco Connect Cloud is not perfect, however. Well, since nothing is perfect, but for more on that and also the performance of the Linksys EA4500, check out the full reviews at CR.com. Once again, my name is Dongo, and this has been the first look at the Cisco Connect Cloud and the Linksys EA4500 router.